I'm Rick Fader. I'm running for Congress. Uh, before we start, first of all, I want to give a big shout out and a thank you to the organizers and all of you beautiful people joining us here today. Uh, you could have been at Costco, Home Depot, Bed Bath and Beyond, but you chose to be here to fight for freedom. So please stand with me as we do our Pledge of Allegiance. Pledge of Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now, we're celebrating a lot here for freedom, uh, and uh, one of our rights to celebrate is a very special happy birthday. <laughs> if you guys could join me singing happy birthday to one of our fearless leaders for this convoy, Mary Sue. On the count of three, one, two, Three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Meredith. Happy birthday to you. Listen, we live in a beautiful country that gives us the right to congregate. It gives us the right to assemble. And those rights right now are under attack, okay? You've got these overzealous bureaucrats in some of these buildings right here in Trenton that are trying to take away your constitutional rights, your First Amendment, your Second Amendment, and all of our God-given constitutional rights that our forefathers fought for to make sure that we can stand here. The same reasons that my father and mother immigrated here legally. All of us come from somewhere special. All of us come here because it's the land of the free, and we got to keep it that way. So. To that end, I want to give a special shout out to our organizers here, Zach and Allie from the New Jersey Truckers uh, for Freedom and the Freedom Fellowship. Uh, what a fantastic job they've done here uh, today to get everyone together. Thank you guys for standing up. Listen, I remember in 2019 when I launched my campaign against Cory Booker, I launched on one premise. I launched on the fact that I was going to make sure that I'll run for office to make sure that our American dream 